Dear students, the title of today's story is Unique Mantra. Ramanuj Acharya was a famous scholar of ancient times. He was born in the village of Peru Budur near the city of Madras. He was sent away to receive education when he was a child and his guru taught the young disciple very diligently. After his education was completed, the guru said, Son, I am initiating you and giving you a mantra. Just listening to this mantra leads to one to heaven. But you will not share it with anyone else. Ramanuja received the initiation of the mantra with great reverence. The mantra was Om Namo Narayana. Before leaving the ashram, the Guru once again warned, Ramanuja, take care that this mantra should not fall at the ears of an inept person. On the way, Ramanuja started thinking in his mind, How immense is the power of this mantra? Heaven can be attained only by listening to it. Then this heart said, Why can't everyone get to attain heaven? The feeling of human welfare was seeded deep in Ramanuja's heart. Although he wanted to obey his guru's orders completely, his heart's yearning for the welfare of humanity could not stop him. He got the entire state to start chanting the said mantra. So, everyone started chanting that mantra. When Guruji came to know about this, he got very angry. He asked Ramanujan, Why did you do this? Ramanujan said, I am sorry, Gurudev. Knowing that chanting this mantra will lead to heaven, I could not keep it just to myself. I deserve punishment. But since this benefits the entire humanity, I happily accept the punishment. Hearing the answer of the disciple, the Guru's heart was filled with love. He embraced Ramanujan and said, Son, you are a true seeker. How can you go to hell? One who thinks for the betterment of all will always find happiness. You are an Acharya. That means teacher in a true sense. Ramanuj Acharya bowed at the feet of his Guru. A true human is not the one who thinks only of himself. Being human means doing good for others. The path of spirituality is for the bold and courageous. What is the point of our life if we can't become a better person? More merciful and more charitable than before. Moral is the one who gives continuously is never empty. A pure heart attached to the source naturally 
pours forth with goodness, generosity and love. I hope you enjoyed the story. Thank you and have a nice day ahead.